to the French comedy talk show with me, Skipper France. And today I am going to be interviewing an author. That's very nice, isn't it? And I'm going to interview him about his book called The Creature from the Monorail. And some of his other books are called The Graffiti Godzilla, The Evil Yogurt Cup, and this is not the last book he wrote, but he wrote very many others. And this book is called The Leaning Tower of Pisa. But if you have to say Pete and then Za, please be my guest. And now, let's all give a very warm welcome to Beatrix Bon Cookie. <laughs> wait, 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 Bon Cookie. Okay, yeah, yay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that name sounds yummy, you know. <laughs> Okay. Um, hi. Your last, is your last name yummy? <laughs> I don't know. Sounds yummy. I don't know. I like cookies. Alright. Okay, whatever. So, well, can you tell us about your book? Beatrix? Um, well, I wrote it. Um, well, yes, you wrote it. Uh -huh. You did write it. Okay, and um, so can you tell us a little information about it? Something about what? The book. What book? Oh, book. right. Oh, that book, right? <gasps> yes, that book. Uh, <clears throat> All right. So, basic storyline is this guy on a trip to Disney World with his parents. I wish they were just kidding about your size. I'm not saying you're okay, but whatever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So he tells us. Monster like fruit from. Where you Wait, might remind you of something from Sesame Street. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, <laughs> Wait. So. Wait, are you talking about that thing? cookie guy? Yeah, something like that. Okay, yay. Cookie monster or whatever. I like cookies. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> so, I like him. Um, so. He, in the first chapter, he believes that he's defeated this so called monster and all of his problems are over. In the end, he realizes that his problems are far from over. He ends up defeating this monster and a love life for himself. And like most good stories. And it's happily, girlfriend hat. I don't know. I didn't do illustrations. Who does so, the illustrations? I don't do illustrations, it's a chapter book. So right. I'm reading a chapter book. It has illustrations. Okay, whatever. Okay. So good book. Good enough to get published. Mm. Hold myself public copy so by that refrigerator I've always wanted at the couch. You want a refrigerator and yeah. a couch? Yeah, the refrigerator is cool. Get it? Ha ha ha. Cool. Um, ha ha. I'm not funny. Uh, yeah. Not funny. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, um. Is that really fun? Whatever! I don't care. Okay. <laughs> so! Can you maybe read us one or two chapters of your book? I suppose. Alright. Yay! A little Story time. Okay. It's just like we school. Yay. <laughs> Even though Chapter Pascal one. was like 16 years Chapter ago. one, the encounter. I could not stop running. Not after I saw this gigantic cookie monster hanging from the Disney World monorail. No! I screamed. Don't take me near it! We slowly continued closer. I could now hear its evil voice repeating, I'm a good cookie. I'm a good cookie. Over and over in my head. I started to bang on the window to try and break out until I remembered how high up I was. Was there any monitoring on the monorail? His evil voice started to get louder. Uh, 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 which started to rumble the monorail. Immediately, I took a sledgehammer to the window. Crash! I threw a huge cookie out the window. Cookies! from the big blue freak as he jumped to get the cookie. He fell into the bottomless abyss. All of my problems were finally over. Or so I thought. Yay! I was I was also having fun trying to get out. Okay, Sorry. even though I was like, Yay! Let's do a round of applause. You know, oh like a circle or whatever okay, they okay. do in school. That's great. Okay. okay, so well, that was um interesting. Yeah. Okay. Um, 
and next time on the French comedy talk show. Bye bye. Yeah, no, no, no. Bye bye.